Hey, good looking. I'm Vixen, and welcome back, or welcome for the first time. In the last episode, this happened. That's the creepiest thing I've seen all day. Let the epic story continue. Very good, very good. The sentiment is surely appreciated, Miss White. But it doesn't disguise the fact that these accusations are completely unfounded. They're not unfounded. The sheriff Confound your unfounded. Article of evidence linking me to the. Georgie murders. was working for you. Bigby got a confession. A confession that, that nobody heard. Now, I'm no barrister, but I think such a statement would carry more weight if Bigby weren't the only one to whom Georgie spoke, especially given Bigby's history. What are you mm. talking about? Snow. What about your history? And what about your history? All you've done to this fucking town. What do you mean there's no evidence? Uh-oh. Maybe, maybe he's... I mean, this doesn't feel right. How oh, no. This? I just Of need. course it's right. This man tormented all of Where you. Where was I For supposed profit. to get evidence? Georgie Let killed him. make sure I understand you. You're trying to say that I'm responsible for what Georgie did because he was working for me at the time, yes? Yes. Of course. Yes, you're responsible. Yes, you're responsible. If I'm to blame for Georgie's mistakes, shouldn't Miss White be held accountable for Bigby's actions as well? Well, I'm working for... Like what? How about the way he treated poor Tweedle D when he was in your custody? I didn't do anything to him. He was beaten to mashed apples while under that your That wasn't watch. me. Under my watch. Maybe he's right. Did you think we'd all just let that go? You can't be serious. That was different. What? That was Bluebeard, not me. He was a murder suspect. Besides, Crane was still deputy mayor when that happened. Right before you decided to kidnap him. It was for his own protection. Yeah, sure. Oh, you're right, dear. Crane was in charge. Sometimes Where it's is hard Crane? To tell the difference. Oh, That's Paris. enough. So, you won't answer for your employee's behavior, but I must perish for this mine. This is completely different. I we did all... not order those two girls dead. It simply never happened. Prove it. Georgie killed Faith and Lily. End of story. They want to scapegoat me for their own tangled ends, but they refuse to answer for their How own. How was I supposed crisis. to get it? Oh, please. This isn't the point. We'll deal with them after we deal with you. Listen, I the know. The laws apply when we need calm them. Calm down. Bluebeard, please. Let's just. Everyone calm down. Keep a level this head. A certain level of privilege should be afforded to, to who? This is how it's always been. This is what I'm talking about. We lashed our ropes to this diseased world, and ever since, How is I supposed which to get one of evidence? us has been there for you? Who filled your lives with the promise of more? Who was the God damn! I hate his bloody towers, talking. Judging you, treating you as mindless. That wasn't me. I've done everything I can to, to protect these destiny. people. Without me, who will pay your rent when you're on the verge of eviction? Someone who doesn't ask so much who will interest. Who challenge their brutality when it leaks to our dear citizens? I didn't touch him. Who will protect you from the big bad wolf? I'm protecting them. Who will be the- Bigby! Miss White! Ah, she can speak now. Excuse I... me, dear. I wanted to make sure I had the chance to say He's something. gonna pull the Why ribbon. You take a moment to catch your breath? What's and it won't work, because Vivian's dead. I'd like to- I, I need to say something. We're kind of in the middle of something. Go ahead. Bluebeard. Uh, of course. Go right ahead. You probably don't remember me. I don't know why I was afraid to come My here. Dear, I don't Just know shut you... up. You enslaved you, us for years. Let us hear stories about what you do. Told us we would lose everything if we stepped just one toe out of line. And we couldn't say a word about it because of these damn ribbons. <laughs> but you know what? Now it's my turn to talk. How are you? I found Vivian's body. Did you kill her? She killed herself. Did he? Sheriff, this is highly irregular. Be quiet. We need to establish some she more. She wanted you freed. Vivian wanted you freed from the ribbons. She took her own life. I'm sorry, um, I don't think I Nerissa! Knew... My name is Nerissa. It's okay, my dear. It's going to He's be so he creepy. He ordered them dead. This fucker. Faith and Lily. That's a lie. I was in the goddamn room when he did it. Yeah. Faith and Lily are dead because of you. The only two people who ever gave a damn about me. 
And now I can finally say you're an asshole. <laughs> and I hope you rot at the bottom of the witching this well for which it. you did. And this just confirms it. He made Georgie do it. It was yes, always Yes, I him. am winning the crowd. Georgie would have never done anything without his say so. Ever. You're going to take the word of a stupid... At least five other girls will back me up on this. We all heard you say it. This is why you don't talk with other people in the room. What a fool. Looks like we found our evidence. She saw it firsthand. He's guilty. Good enough for me. Me too. So that's it. Calm <sighs> down the witching well. No, that's too These fucking easy. These people change their minds like so easily. What do you mean? He's got to pay for what he did. Listen to yourselves. You're all rats, fleeing from one sinking ship to the next. Yeah, and you profit so on it. So quick to latch onto whatever will keep your miserable lives afloat. Oh, shut up. This is how you want to repay all I've done You've for done you. nothing but help what? yourself. You take two people's lives away and now you want mercy? You know we can't let you go free after this. What did you expect? What did you expect to happen here? You're getting what you deserve. Well done, then. You didn't now, expect me to do that, sentence. did you? We don't have to become murderers. What are you talking about? He's guilty. I know that, but we don't have to kill anybody. We can imprison him. Lock him up forever. Somewhere he can never hurt anyone again. How can we be sure he won't escape? I can help. What if Buddy no, Mary's magic. still alive? That's not good enough. Maybe there will be more if he isn't stopped. Oh, oh no, this is a choice. We can get him out of here. We can send him Everyone, away. listen up. Clearly, we're having trouble agreeing on a suitable punishment, so I think this we- This is going nowhere. Someone needs to make a decision. Who? We should vote. I hope you aren't suggesting yourself. We should have a vote. Make it democratic. Do you really think that's going to work? Yes. He's right. Nobody can agree on anything. What about Bigby? What about him? He was appointed. He's the only official representative, really. He should be the judge. I said a vote. That makes sense to me. I guess it does. Okay. Fine. Oh no. Are you sure? This isn't how it's- It's what the people want, Miss Wolf. Oh no. Okay, Mr. Wolf. Oh no. It's your call. Do I kill him no. or- Just do what you think is right. But leaving him alive could be more dangerous than killing him. Yes, Sheriff. Represent him. Do what you think is right. Teach him a fucking lesson. No. He has to die. We can lock him Just away. fucking get rid of him. Oh god. Well, I didn't make a choice. Ugh. Now he's killed himself, hasn't he? The fool. Ugh. Ugh. You didn't give me a choice, dude. There you are. Shut up. I hope you all remember this moment. Think of me when you try to sleep. Finish Lock him it, up. Sheriff. Don't do it. I'm not a bad person. I'm not a bad person. You can still you believe in me. A way to keep him from hurting people. Wait, you After can't. What be he's serious. done? You're just gonna put him in prison? This isn't the way, Sheriff. You're doing the right thing. Oh God. Yes. There's a way. Is it though? All right, do it. The north wind blows. Well, he's still alive. One day later. Did he escape? That was fast. How beautiful. Right by the flowers that need oxygen to breathe. Hello. You have a crow. Oh, look, it's Flycatcher. Not what I was expecting. Oh, Morning. it's a uh, crooked man. Ben? He's a He's crow. He's got a sharp tongue. I thought it would be better for everyone if he parted with it. Thanks, Grimley. Maybe get a better cage? Let's just call it even. Hey, Sheriff. Hello. Are you going to come see the truck off? We're leaving for the farm in a few. Thought you might want to. Well, I don't know. I'll be down in a minute. They're going to the okay. farm. Great. Something feels man. weird about the flycatcher. You can take your ribbon off now. <sighs> oh, uh, Mr. Wolf, flycatcher left his keys. Thank you. Well, this is mundane. Everything okay? Is everything okay? 
You look... I'm... I'm sorry, Sheriff. I have to take care of this. Maybe you should get some help? We'll talk later, okay? Yeah, I have more people. Not Bluebeard. Good morning, Miss White. <sighs> You're late. Ugh. Back to the daily grind, eh? Someone's Hi, Colin. Gonna see you, Colin. Don't wink at me, pig. I can't protect you forever, can I? But if Snow White walked out right now. There's a bus going to the farm as we speak. <sighs> Where did he even get beer? I feel like the crooked man is going to escape. Something really bad is going to happen. That cage is going to fall off the back of the bloody truck. Oh, Gowan. Jesus. I gave you money for a glamour. We only have like five minutes. They carry me for fuck's sake. I don't give a shit. <laughs> you forgot these. Oh, thank you. It's uh, been pretty busy around here. Morning, Sheriff. I gave you money. Most fucking day. Ugh. Shit! Just go grab that, would I you? I tried to help. Sorry Doesn't about care. all this. Uh, I tried to help. Just why the hell did she have to send me and me boy away? Because you're huh? frogs. You promised me I'll get another chance. But Miss White said I had to go up to the damn farm anyway. I gave I you money for the glamour. The money. Well, she didn't want it. That's not my fault. Wait, Sheriff Bigby. I have something. <laughs> You know, he was up crying all night, poor kid. Can you give this to Miss White, please? Dad says there's no time to say goodbye, so... Is it her, his if weevil? You could bring it to her? Sure. Yeah, sure. I couldn't take them all with me, and she said she liked that one the best. It's a uh. willow beetle. That's a big one. They're cool, because when they're little, they have these pouches she'll that love it. squirt juice in <laughs> you if you touch them. I'm sure she'll love it. She said it was pretty. We're about ready to head out. What's it like at the <sighs> farm? I've heard ogres live there, and, and they eat people in their sleep sometimes. God, I hope not. Do we have to go? I want to stay here. Well, we don't have a choice anymore. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, TJ. But, uh, look on the bright side, okay? There's plenty of space to run around, uh, and a nice river nearby so you can swim all you want. Even in daytime? Yeah, you don't have to worry about the Monday seeing you. It'll be nice. <laughs> Come on, it won't be so bad. Have you been there before? No, I'm, uh, some of the animals aren't comfortable around wolves. So you wouldn't know, would you? We're all set. I... I tried. Bye, Mr. Wolf. Goodbye, TJ. Hey, Bigby! Where's your friend, Colin? Oh, God. Where's a fucking pig? Don't say anything. There's no good answer to that. Right. That's what I thought. Grandmaster Librarian. I unlocked them all. Saying goodbye. Narissa. You're free. I feel like Snow White is going to be the antagonist of the second season. Hi. Hi. You're still wearing that thing. Oh. Yeah. I guess I am. It's not easy to forget. I know it seems like I should be able to. It's just... I understand. It's okay. I get it. In her own time. There's Listen, no reason she I, needs to do it now. I came here because I have to tell you something. What is it? It's about what happened to Faith and Lily. I'm not sure where to start. Did you lie? <sighs> Faith, Lily, and I, we had this plan. We we're gonna find a way out. 
leave the pudding and pie for good. But then Faith decided to get some leverage. She stole a picture of Crane and Lily together. The minute Faith stole that photo, we had dirt on one of the crooked man's allies. If he found out, I... I had no choice. You lied. You have to understand. You've seen how they kept us quiet in that place. Can you imagine the lengths they go just to silence someone who had physical just, evidence? Just... Nerissa, just tell me what happened. I freaked out, okay? I thought if I came clean to Georgie, he'd get the crooked man to leave us alone. We could just forget the whole thing. Maybe try again in a few years. You what? So I told him everything. And I begged for well, mercy. Well, I'm glad I didn't kill the crooked man then. I didn't want anyone to die over a picture. You were <sighs> just trying to protect them. Yeah. Georgie promised he'd smooth things over with the crooked man. And we know and how then... that worked out. Oh, God. <laughs> it's all right. Tell me more. I don't know what happened, but that night at the club, Georgie came back and told me things had changed. He had to make an example of us. We had committed treason. And while the two of us were sitting there, as he was telling me this, Faith walked in, and I had to watch while Georgie... Wait, so Georgie told you all this? Not the crooked man? Back at the well, you said... I know what I said. I'm glad I didn't kill him. But it wasn't the truth, was it? What does it matter? I know the crooked man did it. So what if it wasn't the whole truth? It was true enough. It's for the best. I guess... I guess it worked out in the end. Can't hold that against you. I know he ordered their deaths. I wasn't gonna let him get away with it because of a stupid technique. Well, he's done more than that as especially well. Especially after. Vivian? That night, after Faith, I tried to warn Lily, but she wasn't with her scheduled appointment. So I did the only thing I could do. I. I left Faith's head at your doorstep. It was you. You? I walked her over here, and I left her, just hoping that maybe if I couldn't the save them... The piece of fabric was so from you. That piece of fabric I found near there, that was you. You hurt yourself. Yeah. I cut my leg trying to get over the fence. So you... you started all this. I just pointed you in the right direction. People like us get forgotten all the time. The crooked man was counting on that. Well, he's when still a we dick. Suffer, we do it in silence. And the world likes it that way. We just... fade. Like we never existed. I couldn't watch that happen to Faith. Or Lily. Nobody cares about us. Not really. It's not true. It's not true. It is. You've just never seen it before. But now you have. You'll make things right. You and Snow. I don't know. Seems like no matter what I do, it's just not enough for her or anyone. I just can't win with these people. That's because they still see me as the big bad way, wolf. They need you, Bigby. Both of you. You two make a good team. The way you look out for each other and look out for us. You don't see that a lot these days. I don't know. I don't really know where we stand anymore. Things are just different. Huh. Things are always different. So where are you going? Look, Bigby. After everything you've done for us, maybe they don't want to admit it, but without you, none of this would have happened. You listened when no one else would. You knew when to show mercy, and you brought justice to this town. Finally. For now, someone else because will take over. you brought the crooked man in, everyone saw who he really was. So from where I'm standing, you did the right thing. Well, he's not you dead, so... For a reason. And I left Faith at your doorstep because I knew if anyone stood a chance against the crooked man, well, it was you. I hope I've at least done some good here. You've changed this place. For better or worse, Fable Town wouldn't be the same without you. Hmm. Better or worse. Thanks, anyway. At least that's one vote of conf confidence and one person who doesn't yell at me. 
You're not as bad as everyone says you are. That's what Faith said. I need to tell you something. I have to tell you something. I feel like we've met before. You're trying to place me. You like my ribbon? Do you like it? Faith wore one too. They sisters? Would so she could escape his kingdom. They used to call me the Little Mermaid. Did Dr. Swinehart ever get back to you about Faith? He said he wanted to run more tests. I She's hope you find Faith? what you're looking for. Go after her? I'll see you around. Wolf. Why would I just let her go? I need to know. Happily ever after. Well, that's all for today, folks, but the story will continue. I hope you all have a wonderful afternoon, evening, morning, or whatever it is, wherever you are. I will see you all in the future. TTFN and cheerio!